All right, I wanted to make this video because I know that right now the anxiety is running very high for a lot of students that were waitlisted for medical school. Um, if you guys are new to my channel, my name is Aaron. I'm a first year med student. I was rejected the first time I applied to med school. I was waitlisted the second time and then I got in. So I know that today, April 30th, anxiety is running extremely high for a lot of pre-meds. Um, if you have been waitlisted or if you're even waiting for uh, a notification, sometimes med schools don't accept students until after this wave too. So I just want you guys to know that it's not embarrassing and don't be ashamed if you guys have been waitlisted. I think that being waitlisted isn't talked about enough by uh, pre-med counselors or just anybody really just because there's like a stigma, stigma of being embarrassed or ashamed about being waitlisted. But I want you guys to know that uh, keep your heads up, keep your hopes up high. Um, you guys have made it this far and that's an amazing accomplishment already, okay? Not many people get to this stage and I just want you guys to know that if you guys just keep keep working hard, if you guys stay persistent, if you guys stay pers persevering, um, if you guys don't get in this year, it's all right. It's not the end of the world. You guys can apply next year. Just keep on working hard. Uh, work on that application and don't ever give up hope if you really want to be a doctor then this is part of the process it sucks there's not enough uh, spots for medical school currently and even less for residencies so it's a very competitive process you guys are competing with the best of the best um, students all around the world and it's like i said it's a competitive process so keep moving forward i wasn't accepted until may 10th so that was like 10 days after this big influx and movement on wait lists and I know the anxiety was awful and I just wanted to share my story a little bit with you guys so that you guys it might not help your ease it might help you ease up a little bit but I think just uh, try to stay off websites like SDN I think that was really killing me when <laughs> I was waitlisted and try to stay positive I'm rooting for all of you guys and I promise that if you guys uh, continue to do hard work if you guys persevere you guys We'll make it in if this is really what you want to do and if it's what you're meant to do. Bye.